Hey there ladies and gentlemen, my name is Gabriel Joseph and uh, I'm coming to you uh, to talk to you about uh, a diet called the HCG diet. And uh, just recently I purchased, in fact, I purchased this bottle dropper of HCG. It's called Vital HCG and, or uh, Amazing HCG, but it's sold by Vital HCG. If you go to vitalhcg.com, you can check that out. But I wanted to find out if all of the hype around the uh, HCG diet was you know, accurate. And so, um, uh, you know, there's two different forms of HCG. There's the real hormone that's a prescription. Uh, you have to go see a doctor and it's injectable into your body. Then there's this kind, which is the um, homeopathic liquid drops. And homeopathics work different than, uh, you know, the normal home hormone, but they have the same effect on your body. And so at least that's what's being said out there on the internet. So I wanted to really kind of test it. Um, in conjunction with that, I got a couple of the other products that the website was offering. And uh, the Tau Trim Tea was one of them, so I'll be giving you my feedback. Uh, I'm on day five of the diet right now, and trust me, uh, I take the Tau Trim Tea in the morning. It's all natural, no stimulants in it. And uh, <laughs> about midday, ooh, it hits you, if you know what I'm saying. you got to be close to a bathroom. Um, and what it's designed for is it's a colon cleanser. So... I think that it's doing its job so far. The next one is this uh, Night Trim, which is an appetite suppressant, weight loss, uh, um, I don't know, maximizer or stimulator. And it's got Hoodia in it, which is pretty well known. Uh, but what it does is suppresses your appetite. But this one actually has absolutely no stimulants in it. Um, it's got no caffeine, etc. And I wanted one to be able to take after, right before or right after dinner so I could crush my uh, cravings and uh, really help with that, you know, the cravings after dinner before I go to bed type of thing. And it's been working out pretty good so far. Haven't been overly hungry or anything else. Uh, last one is this resveratrol. And resveratrol, you can go figure it out. Uh, do some research online, but in a nutshell, it's known as the French Paradox. You know, 60 Minutes did a uh, real cool special on it. And, uh, you know, the paradox is the French are generally, they eat unhealthy and uh, they smoke a whole lot, but yet they have a lot less um, um, uh, chances or, or percentage-wise, they, they have a lot less heart attacks and heart diseases. And so a study was done on it, and the answer is because they drink a lot of red wine, resveratrol is a chemical within the grape, and uh, when it releases into your body, uh, it actually cuts down the cholesterol levels uh, that are in your body and coursing through your veins and arteries. So with that being said, if you have been living an unhealthy lifestyle like I had, lack of exercise, eating a poor diet, etc., there's probably a buildup of cholesterol in your veins. So I, I figured I'd go ahead and try that one out as well. And uh, then what I did is um, I started the HCG diet, like I said, uh, and it's a really defined protocol. Uh, the first two days, which is known as phase one, you just eat as much fatty food as you possibly can while you're loading on the HCG drops. And it's done pretty easy. I mean, it's got this little dropper that's inside the HCG. You just get a little bit of that, a couple, uh, about 10 drops right under the tongue three times a day. That's how you take it. It's really simple. So you load on the HCG uh, as well as taking some really fatty uh, intake of food. As many calories as you can, as fatty as you can, because then on day three it starts with phase two, which is a, it's called a very low uh, or very restricted low calorie diet. And um, you cut down to about 500 calories of intake of food per day. But what happens is the uh, HCG uh, is turning and making your body uh, burn its internal or deep fat stores. So that's the story anyways. We're figuring out if that works right now or not. So I started off and I uh, took some measurements. Uh, the one that I'll just tell you about was uh, my hips. And that's the one that I'm really concerned about and my waist because I want to fit back into my pants that don't fit anymore and I don't want to have a size 41 and a half inch waist. I couldn't believe I got that fat just sitting in front of a computer eating unhealthy. I mean, I mean, I guess I can believe it, but when I really took a look at the numbers and then my weight, I was 233 pounds and after the, the load or the, you know, the binge phase, the phase one of the diet, I was 235 and a half pounds. I mean, check out the photos, check out the videos. I'm a fat sucker. 
and uh, I don't want to be fat. And on top of that, more importantly, I don't want to be unhealthy. Um, so with that being said, I had a 41 and a half inch waist and a 46 inch hip. So uh, I got had, had some junk in the trunk, if you know what I'm saying. Um, so after five days, the first two days, and this is my third day of phase two, um, I am down to 229 pounds uh, as of this morning. That's a six pound weight loss and I couldn't be happier. So uh, stick around. Let's figure out if over the long haul this thing works. I'm going to be showing you my meal prep. Uh, I'm going to be showing you uh, how I do my uh, weekly calendar, my, my meal plan and everything else to make this thing as easy as possible for me. Uh, and I'd love to get your feedback and comments as well. So again, this is Gabriel Joseph. Uh, come back and, and check out all of my different uh, uh, blog posts. Uh, figure out how the HCG diet is working for me. But uh, more importantly, you know, get inspired to life. This The one reason why I really started doing this diet is because I was motivated to live a healthy lifestyle and I needed um, the vehicle, if you will. Like I needed a jump start to get back into the swing of things of eating healthy, uh, exercising, living a healthy lifestyle, etc. And the HCG diet has really started that process for me. So, um, but all of my other blog posts, I'm all about getting inspired and taking action to make a difference in your life. So come back and check that out as well and feel free to uh, leave any comments. Uh, hook up with me on uh, Facebook. Uh, all of the links are just right over there on the right-hand column on my blog. Scroll down just a little bit and uh, connect with me, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. You name it, I'm there. My name is Gabriel Joseph, and I will be your guide. No, I hated that. That was, that was crappy, right? I'll be your guide through my weight loss journey, and hopefully um, that will lead you to a weight loss journey as well if that's something that is needful in your life and uh, if that's something that could lead to some inspiration for you. So, talk to you later. I'm out.